Okay, so we were just talking about trying to understand why the place where the perpendicular bisectors intersect is the same distance from all three of the vertices. Hmm. Well, it's... You do have a lot of symmetry here. You have the... So it cuts all the sides in half. It cuts all the sides in half, okay. So let's look at just one of these lines here. Let's say this one. Yeah. Can you, can you give me the pencil? I'll just lay that pencil on that, that perpendicular bisector. Yep. And it doesn't go through that vertex. I mean, as you can see with this other one here, which obviously doesn't go through the other vertex. But what is, so tell me some things you notice about this line here. Well, it cuts this one in half. It cuts that, line, that side of the triangle in half, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, it kind of makes another triangle like here. Yeah, it does. Oh, but it may not be a triangle. Look. Two. You sort of have a little triangle. What are some other things you notice about this line? Hmm. hmm. Well. <coughs> it doesn't go through this vertex. No, it does not. What was special about this point? It was, it's the intersection of the perpendicular bisectors. Yeah. And it's the same distance from all of these. It's the same distance from all three of the vertices. Yeah. So what do you notice about this line? Well, is it... Well, is it, like, twice that distance? Because well, this is these are vertices. No. Yeah. Hmm. So... But What's it's special it's, about this but line? But it's on the perpendicular bisector. Yeah, that line is the perpendicular bisector of that side. So what's special about that line? Well, it has that point on it. It does have that point on it. It cuts this side in half. Okay, good. It cuts this side in half. So what's special about this point? Well, it's well, that's, that's the middle. Okay. And it's the same distance away from these two points. Okay, what about this point? It's the same distance away from this, this, and this. Okay, so what's the same about this point and this point? Well, they're, these, they're both the same distance away from some points. Well, they're both the same distance. Well, I don't think these are the same distance, but they're both, they both have equally spaced points near them. Okay. What do you think is special about this line? Well, well, maybe it's maybe all the, all the points are in that line have that property. What property? The property that it intersects, it, the, it cuts like a, a line running from these two points in half. Interest. So maybe all the points in this line are part of a all the points in this line are part of the perpendicular bisector. So that must happen. Okay. So what must happen? So it must cut the line in half. It's running. At, another line, an imaginary line in half that's running from these two points. Okay, so every point on this line has what property? Well, it has the property that if you draw a line, so you pick a point on this line, you draw a line from this point to it, you draw a line from this point to it, they're, they're the same line. Okay, but well they're not the same they're line. They're the same distance. Okay, so every point on this line has what property? It has the property that it's the same distance away from two of the, from these two points. Interesting. All right. So let's go to the next one.